Hello once again everyone, Original Blood Ace back again, and we're talking some Zelda news and, well, Anuma news, I suppose. Came across this, that, um, apparently the Legend of Zelda producer Anuma says a lot of fans want Link to speak. You all know how I feel about this. Very simple. No, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Times infinity to the tenth power. No, 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 no. So, either way, he says, We've had a lot of requests from fans to hear Link's voice. Let's start right off saying, Those aren't the fans. Those are idiots and or people who just want to ruin Zelda because they can't have it on their PlayStation or Xbox. Uh, but anyway, and while in some ways I do feel that it could be uh, good to have a game where he speaks, part of me also feels that uh, that air of proud independence he has because he doesn't speak is a precious part of his, the indiv bleh, individuality of his character. I want to think long and hard about whether changing that would be for the better or not before I make any decision. Let me point this out to you, Anuma. We all know, I don't like you very much. You made Wind Waker, which is your best Zelda game. We'll see how Zelda U does, but... No way, in hell, should you ever, and I mean ever, do that. Because if you do, you will never, and I mean ever, be the same again. Do we understand one another? I will hunt you down, Anuma, and I will end you for ruining the Zelda franchise. You do not change something so pivotal. I mean, that would be like making Master Chief in Halo just be gone. Poof. I mean, technically you could say the ODST and Reach. Maybe that's not a good example. Let's like, uh, I don't know, that'd be like in Uncharted, giving Nathan Drake uh, a sex change in one game. and Oh, he's a female now. It, it doesn't work. It just doesn't work. You don't change something that people have grown accustomed to. I understand there's the people that say, oh, times have changed, times... Shut the fuck up and get the fuck out. I am open to other characters in Zelda saying a few key words here and there as actual voice actors, like Zelda, for example. Say, remember in Ocarina of Time, where she's leading you down the tower. Spoilers, by the way. Uh, Ganon's tower when it's falling apart. I'd be fine with them making Zelda say, like, over here, or follow me, or this way. You know, something like that. But I don't want her to be like, so, Link, tell me, where do you think the Triforce is hidden this time? I don't want full sentences. That's not what Zelda's all about. This is not Witcher. This is not any other, uh, like, Skyrim. This is no open-world game. It's Zelda. Zelda is magical because it's the way it is. You don't go around changing shit. And if you think that Miyamoto would let his baby be changed so dramatically. Think again. Zelda is his creation. He's the only one that should have any say over any dramatic changes. And even, I can't see Miyamoto agreeing to that. I don't care if Anuma's the one that makes the games, like he's in charge now. It's still a Miyamoto IP. You bet your ass Anuma doesn't do a lot of stuff without even telling Miyamoto about it. If Link talks, then it's done. I was going to say Star Fox, but Zelda is dead to me. I, can, I won't be able to support it anymore. Maybe in a spin-off, because then I could just ignore it. But for the main Zelda games, don't you dare give him a fucking voice. Don't you fucking dare. Anyway, that's it for this video. We'll see you in the next one.